Hello my friends, I'm Toit Morimi, the ANSYS trainer of Simpal Group. Today I want to talk about how to design a screw in SpaceClaim, so don't miss this video. Welcome to Simpal Group training courses. Today we are going to uh, design a screw in SpaceClaim. So in the first step, we design the top side of the screw. Then uh, you will learn how to create a slot and thread in a space clamp. So let's uh, back to the software. Okay, the first step uh, to creating a 3D model uh, is defining a sketch. I use a ZX sketch plane. Then I create a circle from the center of uh, my origin and click on 3D mode and now you can use pull option to create the top side of your screw easily okay let's do the next part uh, I want to create the central part of the screw uh, I use this uh, plane to as for a sketch and create another circle like this and uh, press on 3D mode and use pull direction and uh, move your mouse to create the center uh, part of the screw okay if you want to uh, fill at the edges of your screw you can also use a pull option first select the edges and then uh, move your mouse like this and Define a radius for fillet, for example, one millimeter, and now you filleted the uh, screw. Okay, the next uh, step is creating a groove on top side of your screw. We need a plane. Uh, you can use a YZ or YX plane. Choose between uh, these and uh, create a rectangular from sketch option and define from center. Uh, after creating a rectangular, you can uh, press on 3D mode, uh, select the surface and use from both side option and uh, the cut option. And, and if you move your mouse to, uh, around, you can see the uh, groove in top side of your screw. And the final step is how to create a thread on your uh, screw uh, and we need again a sketch like this and the next step is creating triangle a triangle with a line uh, like this the dimension is not important just uh, create a desired triangle like this and close the a curve to create uh, a surface after pressing the 3d mode now uh, we want to use this surface and a pull option uh, to create the thread. Okay, press on pull and then uh, select the revolve option. And after uh, selecting the axis, uh, you should select an option and check the revolve helix. Uh, this method helps you to create uh, threads or helical shapes like a spring and set the pitch and uh, height of this uh, thread and move up your mouse with no merge option and what you see is a helical thread on your uh, screw. Try to pass the uh, screw uh, because we are going to cut it with uh, bottom side of uh, the screw so for this uh, we use a, a split body option from here then uh, select the thread and then use this uh, plane to cut it and now you can uh, remove the extra part of your thread and now you have uh, the top side, the groove and uh, thread of your uh, screw. 
and the final step is merging uh, the two bodies with combine option select the bodies and press on combine to have one solid on your uh, design tree thank you for watching this video uh, please subscribe and share our channel with your friends because we are going to create many uh, training courses about ANSYS. Have a good day and bye bye.